Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X-2. Alright, before we uh, head back out into the Thunder Plains, I realized that uh, I never actually came in here for this chapter, so yeah. How's it going everybody? <laughs> Should have seen this place during the concert, they made a killing. Oh, I can, I can imagine. Me? You bet I saw it. I was right in front of the, right in the front row. Oh, there you go. Actually, kind of sounds like it would be kind of uncomfortable considering where we were. <laughs> Hope you're right. Well, maybe we had a, uh, a, uh, maybe we're laid out, you know. Oh, yeah. Concert was incredible. When is your next show? I'm so there. <laughs> How about using Lucas Stadium next time? That'd be perfect, don't you think? It has uh, doubled as a uh, concert venue uh, at least once before, so yeah, successfully. Maybe it's just because I got so pumped up during the concert, but I feel sort of down now. <laughs> the uh, the high is departing. Everything's getting back to normal, so why, why do I feel so blah? I wonder if uh, the, uh, the sphere spring screen had something to do with that too. Alright, how's it going? Got anything new? Yeah, I've only got a potion to sell the other brother. I am here in the room as well sell it anyway. Uh, quick impromptu uh, adjustment. There we go. I'll worry about the accessories later. Don't think we yeah, I think we're nah, I guess. Yeah, I guess, technically. Unless we got anything fighting the Machina, we should be alright as far as accessories go. Alright, so, yeah. Before we head back out to the Thunder Plains, our setups, I just got everybody set to the way they were before we had to deal with the, uh, uh, the cave. So, yeah, just to quickly go over what we've got equipped. And what we'll be using as we, uh, proceed north, northward. And for abilities, yeah, Yuna's obviously done with Dark Knight. Riku on Samurai, still working on Dismissal. And then Pain on Trainer, she's still working on Flurry Guard, so here we go. Alright, with that out of the way, let's go. Back into the rain. Well, that's threatening now that the uh, Lightning Rod Towers are functioning properly again. <laughs> Alright, Chocobo. Right on, Chocobo. Riku, Shinzon Tetsu. Okay, <laughs> I was afraid I have to use a HP flurry to. Uh... Okay, that's what I was thinking of. Hey, Pain! <laughs> you okay? Well, we got the chocobo at least. Ow! Uh, Peyton took a beating on that one. <laughs> Let's heal up. Yuna, please, if you would. And yeah, we'll work here. Should be good to finish it up. Awesome. Alright, let's go. How's it going, guys? You too. Alright, she's on Tetsu. HP flurry and uh, the darkness just in case. So long, buddy. Don't think you ever got your name, but uh, stay warm, eh? Don't want you getting cold out here, you know. All the rain. 
I think the cave is safe enough. Alright. Shots on Tetsu. there. Ooh. I wonder if it's just my eyes playing tricks on me, but this place seems to be looking different every single time we come here. But we're here in the Makalani Woods, which means it's time to uh, change our setup to something a bit more appropriate. All right, here we go. The biggest changes we've made in a while, I think. But anyways, Yuna, she's on the High Road Winds with the Warrior, Beaded Brooch, and Glass Buckle. I have changed the High Road Winds to look like this for the Makalani Woods. So yeah, I got the Warrior and the White Mage. And once we... Uh, oh, and then the, the Samurai and Black Mage there. Uh, once unit is finished learning the uh, Sentinel and SOS Protect, I will be switching that Warrior Dress Sphere to Trainer. So, just heads up there. And Riku, High Road Winds, Samurai, Ribbon, and Ragnarok, and obviously with the uh, potential of running into the Amorphous Gel or Protean Gel here, uh, that's what the Black Age uh, Dress Sphere is for, since it's been a while since we've seen that, so yeah. Be nice to see... Uh, the OG uh, black and white mage in battle, uh, should the, uh, the need arise, so yeah. And for pain, Undying Storm, Trainer, smooth, uh, Speed Bracer, and Smooth Shelling. And I have updated the Undying Storm to look, as you can see there, and yeah, with the uh, potential of running into the Amorphous and Protean Gels, I did swap the Dark Knight Dress Sphere for the Gun Mage there, so that uh, we can send uh, pain over there to... Uh, help out with the uh, scanning down the gels and uh, obviously Yuna at that time will be taking over healing duties for the time being so yeah all right so for abilities Yuna she's working on sentinel still and once she learns that it'll be SOS protect and again as I said I'll be switching her over to uh, trainer once that's learned and obviously her white mage dress here is mastered so we don't have to really look at that Riku still working on dismissal about halfway done there and Black Mage still working on uh, Blazaga there, so yeah. And then for Pain, uh, still working on Flurry Guard there, about two thirds of the way through. And obviously her skills are all learned on the Gun Mage. It's just we're waiting on those uh, last six uh, Blue Bullet skills. So there we go. All right, let's go. So yeah, there's new treasure here. So let's take the the lower path first. And wouldn't you know it, <laughs> the Amorphous Gel already. Alright, uh, that's the Tyro Mighty. Is the Tyro Mighty the one that's immune to death? Yes, it is. Alright, so. And the Amorphous Gel obviously is immune to it as well, so yeah. Alright, so let's uh, get Riku over to. You know, let's just take out the Tyro Mighty first. Gonna do the healing for now. You know, over there, Riku up there. Need the a gun mage. And let's get to work. So, yeah, amorphous gel, 973 HP. So, I actually have expecting Riku to uh, one shot this thing like previously, but uh, yeah. Uh, Hmm, what do you want? Yeah, I'll just use that. Magic stat should be high enough for that, should be enough to keep us alive.
All right, first up, let's scan it. Ow. Quit it. All right, what are we hitting it with? We are hitting it with ice. Lazar it is. I remember when that thing terrified me. <laughs> it's still dangerous, no doubt. It's just... Having a plan definitely uh, helps. <laughs> Alright, uh, which way are we going? Uh, is it this way? Yeah. I don't think I've ever mentioned this, but if you hold circle, actually cut the corner there, but we don't want to do that. Which is part of the reason why I haven't shown it, because we haven't really had a reason to, so yeah. Uh, I get the snow ring, for real this time. I think there might be another spot in the forest here that you can do that with, but I uh, can't remember for sure. Two of them! Let's get a uh, scan going. Oh, I think I know which one we're hitting that one with. Both of them, actually. Ow. Okay, we're going to need more than just uh, a single tar targeted cure for this. Should have been self-explanatory. All right. One down. You okay? Ow. Still hitting it with uh, ice. But, of course, I'm actually going to wait for it to hit me. Yeah, that's what I figured. This is what happened in the Calmlands all that time ago. <laughs> I have not forgotten. <laughs> uh, water. Tetsu. Hey. And we're back up. Not sure if Yuna is up to full, but I think Riku and Pain are.
The encounter rate. How are you doing? It's been a while. Long time no see. Okay, I see it uh, hiding behind there. Yeah, there's two of them again. All right. Dwight Mage. Dwight Mage. Dwight Mage. All right. I cannot see which one. That, okay, they're both fire. Lazara, there. Multi-target Akira. I want to wait for its next attack. One other picture, we can go back to Cure. <laughs> Poor Yuna. Single note. Alright, and water. The bubbles. All right. Am I the only one noticing a pattern here? How? What was that for? <laughs> Didn't get an oversoul, did we? Ow. No. Thought maybe I got it in time. <laughs> uh, water. Catch the More blue rings. All right. Despite appearances, there are other fiends in the uh, woods here. <laughs> Lots of other ones. 
There we go. <laughs> Warrior. Samurai. Trainer. Shins on Tetsu. HP Flurry. And anybody that survives. I guess probably the Varan is probably the most likely to survive, maybe. But it didn't. Good girl. Those fights go much quicker. And there's Sentinel. Awesome. It's beginning to wonder if we would ever even get close to uh, getting you know on the trainer dress here. Alright. SOS protect. How close are you? Very close. But I think that one goes directly into the next one, so yeah. Pain's almost done too. Alright. Ready And there's dismissal. It. And just to confirm that it does go into the next one, finger snap. This skill could have been really useful to have when we were fighting Humbaba there. So yeah, basically just works kind of like a uh, dispel. Sets all of their uh, stat bonuses to back to normal. All right, we made it in here. Let's head up here first. There's Shinra's comms here. Ooh, treasure. How dare ye drag ye sorry bum back here? Ye cast away the family business and ran off for the hills. Gone a whole year ye were. And ye call yourself a walker on a 24. But, but you opened the store again without even telling me. Why, I only left back then because my job was gone. Well, I couldn't help it. I got an itch for peddling, I did. Oh, get in here. Don't want you catching cold. Brother? I'm right ready to pound some business sense into that hapless head of yours. But this doesn't strike me as the best place for getting customers. Don't be a thunderhead. Open your eyes, lad. Maybe he failed to notice our biggest customer has just graced us with her presence. Lady Yuna. Now's your chance to practice, lad. Do it just like I taught ye. All right. Well, welcome to Owakas. You buffoon! Put some spine into it, 
lad. Follow me, example. Welcome to Awakas. Ahem, welcome to Awakas. No, 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 Welcome to a walkers. Red your lips. Welcome to a walkers. That's not how it goes. I didn't ask ye. Everything's returned to normal. I guess. And there is episode complete. For Owaka's Tale. And got an elixir. Nice. Let's head inside. Where it's nice and warm. And yeah, so for paying off Owaka's debt by the end of chapter 3 and all of that fun stuff, Welcome to his shop is officially open. And he sells some rather impressive, if expensive, accessories. <laughs> Which could be rather useful, so yeah. But that's not all. If you can catch once. <laughs> what? <laughs> Wants has his own stock of accessories, so yeah. Chaos Shock. Yeah, we could have used this a long time ago. <laughs> Be able to cast Confuse, yeah. But unfortunately, I do not believe any more of the uh, blue bullet skills we need to collect require us to confuse the enemy, so yeah. Oh well. I wonder if. Uh, or accessories carry over to New Game Plus. I don't think I've ever actually started a New Game Plus of this game, so yeah, be interesting to know. For some reason, I feel like it does, but you know. But. So yeah, we finally made it. Got a bunch of bubbles in our way, or I guess airborne uh, puddles, if you will, <laughs> get in our way, but we made it to Owaka's shop. I almost I lost sight of Yuna there. It's center on the. Uh, the curb it wants calm down man all right so i think i will take a moment here to uh well do i really want to no i think i'll uh yeah we did get quite a few things um yeah well i don't plan on selling the excess uh accessories here but if i change my mind i'll let you know at the start of the next episode but in any case this indeed is where we're going to leave off for today and uh yeah we'll uh go uh back into the makalani woods and uh visit some old uh familiar places once <laughs> <laughs> Wow, anyways, let's try to stay out of his way. This is Intrepid83 signing off. If you've enjoyed the video, I see, please consider, you know, formerly known as Sirk1983. If you've enjoyed the video, I see, please consider hitting the like button on your way out to help support the series here and help uh, get this uh, pl this uh, playthrough to uh, anybody who might be looking for a playthrough of this sort. 100% uh, Final Fantasy X2. And I thank you for helping me do that, because without your help, it'd be nigh impossible for me to do so. So thank you so very much from the bottom of my heart for helping me do that. And if you uh, dislike the video, feel free to hit the dislike button. Maybe leave a comment suggesting how I can improve. I'm always looking for ways to improve my videos. But in any case, if you haven't subscribed over there yet, why not head on over to my other channel, Intrepid83, see if there's anything there over there that could potentially earn your subscription. And if it does, well, I'll see you over there. And until next time, thank you for spending some of your time here. Take care. Be blessed, and have a good one. Oh, and one last thing I forgot to discuss, which I mentioned I would do at the end of the last episode. As soon as I'm about to save here. Is that... 
we reached a certain threshold in completion, and that is 86%. Why is that important? Well, because the last completion checkpoint of the game is 96%, which means we have crossed over into the last 10% of completion before we find out for sure or not, or find out for sure if we have successfully navigated this game, the game, the requirements for 100% completion in Final Fantasy X-2. So yeah, that's the uh, significance of 86%. So yeah, and then obviously uh, getting to 96% is the ultimate goal. So. Well, the ultimate goal is 100%, but 96, if we get 96%, then we know for sure that we've got it. So, yeah, we can start the celebrations, grab some popcorn, and uh, enjoy the rest of the game. So, yeah, just wanted to make sure I covered that since I said I would likely point it out at the end of the last episode. So, yeah, take care.